while working for TSSA, I was sexually harassed by General Secretary Manuel Cortes, and he was enabled by those around him, Luke Chester, Lorraine Ward, and Deputy General Secretary Frank Ward. In May, I did a video with Real News. Since the video went out, many women have joined Me To You and shared their experiences with us of working in the movement and being sexually harassed and in many cases pushed out of their jobs. I've been involved in the trade union movement for 35 years. At the Scottish Trade Union Congress conference, Manuel Cortez harassed me. It was extremely uncomfortable. I didn't know what to do about it. The next day, the president and the assistant general secretary of my own union made reference to what had happened and made a joke out of it. It really made me feel that I'd done something wrong and I was overreacting. And that's why the Me Too movement is so, so important, because this has to be called out. We have been absolutely outraged to see Cortez, Chester and company ingratiating themselves into the recent strike activity in the transport sector. All four have been barred from attending general council meetings and they're not welcome at conference this year. The strikes and the activity in the transport sector is actually crucial and is possibly the beginning of a working class movement those accused should have stood aside. We would like to see a more proactive stance from the TUC, making sure that other unions and their members know who those people are so they can make decisions about who they stand on the picket line with. I have seen lots of women reps and members getting harassed. It really seems to be very common across the movement. We need women to come forward and tell these stories. Bystanders need to stand up and be counted as well and to call this behaviour out wherever they see it. And if it can't happen in the trade union movement, how are we going to tackle this in society? I'd like to invite more women to join me, TU, and to join us at TUC conference this year. We intend to have a presence throughout TUC conference in Brighton.